Hi, this is Michael Gelkin, Raiders beat reporter, Las Vegas Review Journal. A 26 to 10 Raiders loss here in Carson, California to the Los Angeles Chargers. And when you really think about it, not a surprise for Derek Carr to be sacked three times. Not a surprise for this offense to manage fewer than 300 yards. For multiple offensive linemen to be flagged false starts, really critical situations. Third down, goal to go in the red zone. When you look at this state of the offensive line entering this game, again, no shock defensively is troubling. Yes, there are some injuries, of course, the absence of their best player who's in Chicago, but that is over. Uh, you look at Frosty Rucker, he was dealing with a neck injury. Injury is not really enough to explain how efficient Phillip Rivers was allowed to be. It seemed like when defensive coordinator Paul Gunther wanted to call a five-man rush, the Raiders had to face the answer. They felt the perfect antidote for that sort of pressure, which is a short check down screen. Our Chargers with Austin Eckler, with Melvin Gordon, and with wide receiver Keenan Allen over the middle were able just to answer that rush with completions, big gains. Ultimately, the Raiders unable to keep pace and they haven't really this season. One in four now is the record. 0-2 in the AFC West. And with the Raiders looking to catch their breath, with some guys injured looking to get right, they have on a short week a cross-world trip. Cross-country doesn't seem to do it justice. Going into London to face the Seattle Seahawks. So, again, banged up, but need to find a way to win because this season here going into week six, is quickly getting out of hand. According to this is Michael Gelkin. More updates online at ReviewJournal.com as well as in print at Las Vegas Review Journal.